Now, I know you had to deal with that, like you said, being being one of the early women in the game, like you said, one of the very few down here on radio or just in general now on TV every day. I see on your Twitter you always got to deal with the assholes, the the um, what they call trolls. I got to deal yeah. with them, maybe everybody got to deal with them, but some people take the high road a lot more often than joy. <laughs> when did that change for you? Or was that always just how you moved, uh, I guess, in the social media space? Because uh, one part of it is, all right, when you do go back at them, however you go back at it, it just kind of empowers them in a sense because most of these guys, they can't wait for a response from Joy. Right. Like, that's the highlight of day. They're going to show it to every person that they troll with. Like, hey, I got a response. So <laughs> what's the balance for you? It has that kind of bear, how, you know, how you always move to the space. Well, you know, I wasn't always on TV, so, mm -hmm. you know, I don't, I was, you know, let me just stop there. But <laughs> like, I'm, I, I'm, I'm really with the shits. Like if you want to go, we can go. What's, yeah. You know, ain't nothing but air and opportunity between us. If you mm -hmm. really love that life, but they're not. So to me, the, th the troll thing actually started when I was in Miami. Because in radio, when I was doing radio, some I don't know if they still do it, but we used to have a, the, the text line, right? Like you could text into the station. Yeah. And right. sometimes we do it for contests, but they would really want us to use it during the show to like get get fan comments. So our PD would always be like, oh, like read the text line, make sure you're you know, integrating the text line. And I would tell them, I'm not reading this. All <laughs> I'm trying to do the show. There's nothing but bullshit on here. Just people talking shit all day. Occasionally right. there'll be somebody with a thought, but this is why am I, I'm not reading all this like negative yeah. feedback all day. So I would give it to the producers and be like, hey, just pick one, you know, conscious comments on here and we'll read it. But if there are none, we're, there, there are none. So I kind of already had a, a predisposition to the troll community that really exists in its luster as it does now as a young broadcaster. So I, I sort of had a, a tougher skin for it um, that I developed early, which is a good thing now, because as you mentioned, everybody has trolls now. Mm -hmm. Now women get it worse than men. Way worse. For sure. Yeah. And, and black women get it worse than everybody. Mm -hmm. But I just had a different disposition to it. But also I have the mentality that like these people would never say this to my face. To your face, never, facts. Never, yeah. never, never. There's nothing you could ever tell me to make me believe that you will walk up to me in person on the streets of Los Angeles and tell me I'm a fat bitch. There's nothing you could tell me <laughs> to convince me that you would do that. I know you wouldn't do I'm, it. No thousand percent correct. Yeah. There's no chance. Zero. So I can't really take these people seriously. Like you're not really tough and you don't really mean what you're saying because you would never say it to my face. So it's, I also don't have feelings. Like, so I'm like, if I don't, <laughs> if I don't respect, if I don't respect your opinion, like if I wouldn't ask you for advice, why would I respect your criticism? Yeah. Yeah. You know, so, and, and that could apply to a lot of people, but especially an anonymous person on the internet, like I'm not getting in my feelings about that. I got stuff to do today. A lot yeah. of stuff to do. And that is just not on the list. Now, everybody, as you mentioned, <laughs> Darius, everybody doesn't take the road that I take. And, and some people do get upset about what's said about them. And I would say this, and this is what I tell people, especially young people in the business, like about how to deal with it. One, despite the fact that I do sacrifice a troll every now and then, I'm not reading my mentions all day. I'm actually mm -hmm. living my life and doing stuff. So mm -hmm. occasionally I'll get on there, light somebody up, move on with my day. But there'll be <laughs> whole weeks where I don't even get in the mentions. Like I'm not even doing that. I've, I'm just busy. So I would say balance, you know, how much, because I don't think humans are supposed to meant to, to get as much feedback. We're not meant to get as much feedback as we get positive yeah. or negative it's not normal to have this especially when you don't you, you you live on air for three hours yeah. five days out of yeah it's not normal but i'm saying even even not when we're on air like i think humans are not meant to get this much feedback positive mm -hmm. or negative from other people like this is it's not normal what we're yeah. dealing with it's so it's crazy yeah it's just like this vortex that we're in so you have to find a way to balance it with whatever is good for your mental health but I just, to me, if you, if you're going to talk shit, you deserve whatever smoke you get. 
<laughs> and, I like it. And you would never say it to my face, so I'm not gonna get my feelings hurt. But also, I think for me, I know people ask me like, "Why do you bother?" Because you know it probably validates them or whatever. There are a lot of women who tell me all the time, like, "I I love that you do that because I can't do that. Like, my job yeah. would get mad at me, or you know, my boss doesn't want me on the internet." talking like that or i wouldn't even know what to say but i still get it so <laughs> i appreciate that you do that so you know i'm just out here you know just warrior princess in it for those two yeah i like i, it, I, like I, it. I love to see it. i saw somebody on my timeline today getting getting lit up from about five six different uh women in the space on twitter i don't know what that was about i didn't even do i, I, do I saw that too ever, but i said sheesh yeah i saw just, that too which is bad, bad that's a different story we talk about that off air yeah but yeah. man uh, but